and welcome back to this final episode of this extreme let's play we are close now to finishing her off and either we win or we die and if we die well then we've lost kind of now we haven't lost the cause she's not that strong but either we take this island here or we don't and we have ceasefire for another one minute and then it's the final battle here before that happens let's have a look at my city again so we do have investors now and we do have engineers we do have artisans we have all the people here and even all the kinds of people in one island so we have the workers here and the farmers and everyone seems to be rather happy so we have fulfilled all the demands as well and well we could do more of course we could do more for happiness we could also have a bank as far as i can see is that right soon um, and we could have a bank perhaps we could do that as well but let's go back here to miss hunt now the battle is upon us very soon, 30 minutes, 30 seconds. Let's send one of my clippers with some, yeah, some resources there. You know, so we can, just in case, if we win, we can start by building stuff right away. Oh, I'm excited. Look at that. Everyone's preparing now. She's even got a, a ship of hers there now. And I'm very interested to see how this turns out against such a harbor defense here. The last seconds. And the fire starts. Look at that. That ship is going down immediately. Her ship there. Very nice. Let's focus on the cannons here. They've got lots of health. And this ship here is going dangerously low now. But I think this is looking good actually. Let's focus on this cannon. The, fo the cannons need to be destroyed first because they um, do the most damage to my ships. But look at that. The full firepower of so many ship of the lines here. And there's another cannon here. So we have four more defenses of her that we need to destroy. And one of my ships is going down now, I think. And it's too far in here, so I can't put it out there anymore. So yeah, I've lost one of my ships here now, going down as well, a ship of the line, but I think we are actually, yeah, we're going to do that. Looking good. All her defenses are down now, so it's just her harbor building now. And look how that damage is coming in here, so I think that's it for her. That was quick. So many ship of the lines, I'm always surprised how strong they are. And the um, warehouse is down and she's coming close now to the white flag but I think that's it let's destroy this ship there down as well what else do we need to destroy how is she giving up now there it is and we've taken her biggest and her main island Taking all the shares? No, of course not. We are going to conquer this one. Bye bye, Miss Hunt. It was a pleasure playing with you. Oh, she's angry. You know, but she's always angry. I don't know. Let's leave two of our main ships here and send our other flagships now to her last island. Look at that. Beautiful. We've got some plunder here as well. Let's see what she's got here on this island. Well, potatoes, I don't need that. Let's throw that right overboard again. Well, that looks good. Thielmann's tube increases productivity of 50% to soap factories, rendering works, and dy dynamite factories. Very nice. We can definitely use that. And let's see what items she actually has here in this harbor. Look at that. Oh my goodness. That, oh, uh, we have to look at that again. So nice items there. Let's take her last island. She stuck. She still has some cannons here, already firing at my fleet. We're taking heavy damage now, and the frigate is going down soon. But the frigate can go down, you know. It's protecting 
our ship of the lines with that. And let's open fire. And I've lost another ship. But it should not matter, I think. Very nice, let's destroy the next cannon here. Oh, there's some real damage here on her island, on her last remaining island. I'm enjoying this just a lot right now. We lost another ship of the line, but I don't care. She's going down. After so many hours of pure harassment, we finally destroyed Miss Hunt. Even though I'm losing a lot of ships right now, there's another one going down. I've got five more ship of the lines here. That's it now, because those cannons do the most damage. The smaller ones are not that dangerous anymore. Very nice, her last defense is down now as well. With that, we say bye-bye, Miss Hunt. Let's conquer this island here. It's angry you defeated her. My face is full of tears of joy. She's gone. Let's have a look at diplomacy. There is no Miss Hunt anymore. Look at that. Beautiful. We've destroyed her completely, like I promised. No items here in store, unfortunately. There is still something here we can take. But she is gone for good. Oh my good. A competitor has been annihilated. I love that. Some steel beams that we get out of this. Other than that, she is really, really gone. Oh my goodness. Let's have a look at the, at the goods that we got from her. So lots of very nice items. I haven't seen those items before. The Drakkar carving we can use in a museum. Takal's necklace, a telemans tube, we have that already. Do we have some animals? No, no animals, only artifacts for a museum. So let's get our ship here, unload our timber and bricks, because we want, of course, another city here, and especially our bread production, our biggest one. And schnapps as well, because we have potatoes here. And potato is rare in this game, so we definitely should use that. And let's get those artifacts here. And also, this ship of the line is getting some artifacts. And the tube, yeah, for the soap. Very nice. And let's send those ships here to New Catan. And they should be grouped as well, so it's kind of a an escort. Even though we don't have any enemies anymore. Now. And I also want to send those two ship of the lines to the trader, so we sell them. That's a hundred thousand that we get with that, and we need that money. Very nice, very, very nice. And let's start tier Pete. Let's rename that to Hunt's Demise. Love it. I also have my wife and children. Okay, and here we can now start with a marketplace again. This is a beautiful island actually. Look at the size of it. This could be a major city, but we need the production lines for our other major city. So, we cannot do that.
Okay, and let's get a mark a warehouse over here with a lumberjack hut. Three of them. And sawmills. Get some timber in here. Let's have a look. We should have... Yeah, let's just buy this clipper here. It's cheap and we need it. And let's just get some more timber. So enhance the mice, then we have our bread and schnapps production. Of course we need a commuter's pier as well for that. So we have enough schnapps then again for everyone. Because I think, well, here it's not low, I think. No, we have enough schnapps here. Bread is down though. And in Bellrock, I think we need schnapps. No, we don't actually, we have enough. But I could use the space here then, you know, I could get rid of those grain farms entirely. And just have more houses if I want that. Right, and my ships are here already. So in celebration to the victory over Miss Hunt, we're going to have a museum here now. And I would like to have that museum, well, here. There it is. Beautiful building. And of course we need those exhibitions here. So let's see how many we can build. We don't have much influence anyway. But we can build some without having to in invest any influence. As far as I can see. Let's build that pub a bit over here. Yeah, just like that. Like that. Looking good. Just with the pub, so the pub is just along the museum, but that's a bit too close. Let's move the pub a bit far, further away, like so. And then we can have some trees here as a border, kind of, between them. And of course we also want to have some nice ornaments. The Lions, Fountain Square on both sides, and some trees here to make this a bit more beautiful. Do we have any more statues? We should have actually more statues there. Very nice, and now let's put the artifacts to the museum. Drakkar carving. Oh, that looks beautiful. Cutlass. What else do we have here? Takal's necklace. And... Olympian temple remains. Oh, that looks nice. I love it. And so we have a nice little museum here as well, and increased our attractiveness to an ordinary capital. As a celebration to our victory, those are the the goods, the loot that we got from his hunt. And it's the final, the final, well, humiliation, I hope. We've taken her items and put them on display. Very nice. 
Okay, let's have a look back at Hans Demise. We want to, to make this a bit more bigger here, a bit bigger here. In general. So we need a commuter spear as well. Let's set my clipper back. And we have a free clipper here. I want to check how much it costs again. So we need more windows. Oh, we don't have any windows right now. Can we buy them? No. So we have to wait till we have more windows, but it doesn't matter. We can just, you know, have some more farmers here. Of course, we shouldn't forget about a fire station and a pop. And what do my people need? Well, of course, they also want schnapps, so we should start with a schnapps production. We do have potato fertility. Very nice. So all we need is a warehouse here. And then we're going to have those potato farms. 30 seconds each. So they produce a lot of that, actually. That stuff. So let's have four schnapps farms. Potato farms. Schnapps. Your streets are safe again. Okay, and then we need four distilleries. Let's not build them too close to each other. That could end badly again. Okay, very nice. So my people have schnapps now as well. In Hunt's Demise. And we can also sell our ships now. We get some influence back, money, and of course we also increase our balance. Look at that, beautiful. And now we have this big island here. There's oil here, we have iron deposits, so we can have more steel if we want. And there's a clay deposit over there, very nice, so we can have some bricks at least. Um, stuff that we need. Let's get some more timber over there though, I want to speed things up. Yeah, and some bricks. Very nice. So we got Bellrock as one of our bigger cities. Hans the Mice could be a bigger city perhaps if we would continue here. And Yucatan is our jewel. So you would have the option now to get rid of those things here and build and continue. But I don't want that. You know, so we are kind of finished with this game. We've defeated the biggest opponent that we have and we could just build happily away now but that is not so much fun because the islands are not so big and I, I, I rather have a bigger island so again we are waiting for the balance patch and probably the first DLC which should be coming out in the next week or two weeks or something like that they said something about an early release so with that we're going then for a whole new expert let's play with big islands and the neutral traders I think they're very important and then we're going to build the ultimate city bigger than the first sandbox game that we had. So everything then will be a bit better and I'm going to use all my knowledge that I have acquired now. So especially about the pirates and the expeditions, stuff like that to make it a bit more interesting. But it's looking good, my museum is now open, people go through that one here. And one other thing is where we have the first person perspective. This glitch here is going to be removed as well next week with the patch. So this should be more fun then, because right now we have those graphical artifacts. But we can ignore them for now and have a look at the museum here again. So many people walking around, beautiful weather. I love the skybox in this game. Just like that. Beautiful mountain in the background, I love the mountains in this game. 
We can see over there the factories up there on the hill. Oh, I like that a lot. So you see everything the era has to offer, you know, like beautiful places, but also ugly places everywhere. And there's a butcher here. And I think one of those buildings has some creepy window. The, the artisan buildings, not the investor ones. So here we're in the city center now. Very nice city here. And where's the creepy woman? There is a creepy woman here somewhere. Look, ah, yeah, look at that. Now that is creepy as, as fuck. Sorry that I say that, but look at that. She has red eyes even. Why, why has she got red eyes? Can we see that from another perspective? No, we can't. But why has she got red eyes? That is, that is really creepy. No, we can't, we can't see her from here. But I think all the artisan buildings have that. So if we look closely, if I get out of here, we should have another artisan building somewhere with that woman. Oh, there we have the theater. I like it. So the city really has style, you know? I love the Anno 1800 cities. They look very organic, very natural. From down here. There we have the university with the observatory. Of course, we have protesters everywhere. I can't find the creepy woman anymore. Perhaps from this perspective. There she is, look at that. Do you see that on the on the window looking out there? I don't want to live there. Like every single artisan building has that. This creepy girl looking out the window with the red eyes. Very interesting indeed. I don't know. But I love that city. Cozy, small. With all kinds of people living here. We even have a railway here. In the middle. Oh, that's not been interesting. What an amazing game. This game gets easily a 9 out of 10 for me. Minus points are the balancing issues that we have. But other than that, it's just a very, almost a perfect game, yep. Yeah. It's pretty high on my list and definitely the best Anno that I've played since 1404, if not better. No train right now. Oh, there's a coming one, I think. No, it was a ship. I saw... I thought I saw some smoke there. There is a train. And another one. Well guys, this is it. It's been a pleasure playing with this game with you. We have survived longer than I expected. We actually have won this game. So we still have the Admiral, but you know, that's just some naval battles again. That's not really survival. Um, we could defeat him easily with our fleet. And that's it for now. We've built quite a lot. And with the next Let's Play, there's definitely another Let's Play coming. The Expert on uh, a, bit, a bit more balanced then. And we're going for everything then again with, with monuments and with world exhibition. And of course also total domination. So we try to eliminate all our opponents then in this game. And with that in mind, I hope you enjoyed it. Don't be sad, another annual let's play is definitely coming soon. And in the meantime, I'm going to turn towards this, uh, some other games that I can, can enjoy, like Tropico and Sekiro. And I wish you all the best and hope you stay on my channel and see you soon again. Cheers!